While Kestrel Aviation showed off its $225 million ultra luxury 787 Dreamliner modification, you might have missed the machine that measures the sickness of your ollies, CERN's new swarm of monitoring robots, and a deep dreaming toad. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where we just can't get over the civility of a Canadian Black Friday. It's so nice. Are you worried that your ollies aren't hella tight? Do you desperately need more cowbell in your life? If you answered yes to both of these questions, then you might need the sick ollie machine. The goal is to land the sickest ollie. Created by Josh Sheldon, the machine consists of an Arduino-connected skateboard with an accelerometer and a gyroscope that wirelessly transmits data to the Arduino relay that processes it. The machine operates like a hammer game at the carnival, complete with a strip of LEDs that light up to display just how awesome each Ollie is. Truly sick moves earn a coveted cowbell chime, which is probably easier to do than kick flipping in heels. And you wanna or walking in heels. Keeping tabs on the world's largest particle collider is no small feat, and that's why the team at CERN has enlisted the help of two robotic inspectors. The TIM twins, short for Train Inspection Monorail, move along an overhead rail that runs the collider's entire 17-mile circumference. These robots provide live video feeds and environmental measurements, everything from oxygen concentration and temperature to radiation emissions, without making human technicians hoof it through the massive underground complex. And they're certainly more useful than the last robotic twins humanity had to deal with. Could we move along? Run! And if you didn't think that radiation sniffing robots were wild enough, here's a psychedelic toad thanks to Google's Deep Dream Engine. Because that's not terrifying at all.